Yo guys, what's happening everyone? It's your boy here, Abdurrahim. We are back again today with another great and amazing retro gaming. As some of you guys remember, we unboxed the Unbornic RG35XXH and it was really, really amazing gaming. But today we are having something which it's a nostalgic. It captured my mind for the first time I'm seeing it and today we're having it here at the studio. So what is it? Well, it's a Game Boy Micro. So yeah. Ooh, there we go. As some of you guys can see, even the box, it looks so old because this game came out in 2005. And to be honest, it's a really, really nice thing. So it's almost 19 years up to now since this game was announced. And today we are having it full packed on the box. And uh, shout out to Abdul Kadr for sharing with me this game because uh, I was like, damn, I need just to put my hands on it. And uh, I, I have some cartridges here home uh, for the Dragon Ball and many more I'll share with you guys as you can see so we're gonna be testing this game and see how it is because it's a small micro and I saw this game last time or past and past and past and past of years back in the days around 2009 um, at the one store in town and uh, yeah it's some memories you know what I mean so I, I think it's a great thing just to check it out and experience what's goody about this bad boy so guys here is our bad boy as you can see really really nice packed and uh yeah at the back says game boy micro which it's really really amazing now through all these kind of bad boy we're gonna unbox it right now because i'm so so pumped to see this uh bad boy how it is so there we go as some of you guys can see um this is our game i'm gonna keep it aside first and see what's packed inside well we're getting some pepper wax whoa this is incredible uh game boy micro pepper wax looks damn feels 2000 and five-ish uh, really really amazing to be honest um you see the design through here really really nostalgic and uh, this is a japan version and uh, as you can see through here you're having your cloth uh for keeping your game boy micro inside so it's like a bag small bag which you can keep it which it's really really nice and kind of stuff you're having your charging here which it's really really packed and uh, as you can see this is the charger you know they use something like a micro hdmi kind of slot which it's quite not bad but still it's a it's a, the charger for the game boy micro so um it's an ac adapter so yeah guys another kind of stuff which we have here this it's a nintendo club uh dot nintendo dot jp which it means it's a japan so you can get this paper but damn it's so old man because this it's excluded already uh, i don't think if it's included because it's way back you can see you're having like a couple number in here so yeah jumping through all our bad boy right now Woo there we go that's our game boy micro to be honest it's a really really nice one as you can see it has some button in here as some of you guys already know this was the version of like a game boy advance but micro version which i remember i had a game boy advance back in the days but this is the smaller uh kind of mini version of it which is really incredible to be honest and uh it's really really nice the form factor to be honest it's really good uh I can't complain on that or say like damn what it is but it's really really amazing um it feels so small like you can just hold it and keep it in your pocket like it never existed which it's really amazing compared to the game and watch game and watch it's quite bigger you can compare with the game boy micro like you can't you can't because it's quite small and uh, another kind of stuff feels really good but i have bigger hands you know so bigger hands means you can't feel that much great because there's a speaker here you're gonna hide the speaker you won't feel it like the way you clutch in on the game like the unbarnic the way it is like if i'm gonna be playing a game in here with my hand it feels much better but for the game boy micro um you feel smaller but i understand because this was released at my age whereby my hand was a little bit smaller um but right now we have aged so the, the, it's it's quite a little bit different but anyways this is our game boy micro 
feels really dope on here there's an headphone jack to port which is really really amazing so i think it's game time so as we can toss in some cartridges i have some cartridge in, in here uh i have the extreme destruction and i have the dragon ball uh lineup of the cartridges like the Dra dragon ball z the legacy of goku 2 first uh generation of the legacy of goku and this is a second generation of the legacy of goku the part two so i had these cartridges for a long time and uh, i was just keeping them here because it was for the game boy advance and i didn't have a game boy advance and um yeah so i guess it's the time whereby we're going to be testing it and experience on the game and uh played a little bit so as you guys can see and uh it's gonna be really amazing so enough of me talking let's get started i'm gonna just be testing it right now throughout our game here so as you can see what's happening so there we go game boy nintendo nice okay there we go really really incredible to be honest it's just giving me those kind of memories if you continue it takes you somewhere here whereby you can see goku there so my hand if i'm trying to just keep it this way i feel like i'm almost touching my screen this way so it's a little bit different but uh you can see you can fly around you can fight some enemies in here too dead <laughs> so as you can see guys really really cool and uh, it gives you some great amazing kind of memory so let's go back to that level you can see there's another enemy in here okay you can just keep on flying around what's happening with this guy he's shooting me <laughs> okay okay we're having a problem with this game it's like it's lagging or something it's reading and it's lagging so um we have, i just have to clean it you know i just have to remove it and clean it inside and uh, it will just continue working fine so nothing bad after all you guys saw the gameplay looks really really cool to be honest i love the game boy micro my honest thoughts about it it looks really amazing incredible and still you can bowl with it in 2024 you can still use it play around some gaming but you get tired really quickly because of your hand but if you have a smaller hand you're gonna be still enjoying this game so guys my honest thought about the Game Boy Micro to be honest it's really really dope it gives you some nostalgic kind of vibes from back in the days on how you can clutch in on the game how you can enjoy on the game and stuff like that it's a really good game to be honest uh, if you want to just pass some times and uh, it's a really compact I can say because it's so tiny game it's so smaller and uh, it's really well it's half plastic half metal in here so it's a really great amazing uh game from back in the days like throwback but is it worth it in 2024 because uh some of the game right now they've come out so many whereby you can just put the rom there and you just clutch in or you buy an unbarnic or the mio mini depending on you which uh, you find it smoothly because with our hands you can see my hand is so bigger so i prefer something like unbarnic for something like this and Barney Karaji uh, 35XXH. If you didn't check out that review, you can click this card here, either here, and uh, check it out. But overall, this is a great and amazing kind of gaming because it suits my hand perfectly. But for this one, you can see the total difference. You get tired real quickly with your hand. But if you have a smaller hand, this is a really perfectly game to be having. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I didn't have total a lot and a lot of cartridges to just share with you. But we're going to uh, drop an another video perhaps in coming years i guess so if i get some cartridges and storing them here because i want to grab another game boy nintendo the og one which had four batteries and i uh, share with you guys my review because that game has a lot of memories with me too and it's really really remarkable so thank you guys for watching i appreciate it for all of you and uh, some of you guys are not subscribed to the channel make sure that you do a sub to the channel i usually talk about tech i talk about vlog we do bunch and bunch of tech related content and sometimes i'm sharing a cycling vlog which it's really amazing you're gonna enjoy the moment adventure around my home city town of russia and even tanzania you already know what's popping what's goody so it's gonna be really amazing and i'll be catching you guys on the next and amazing tech video and peace